What's up you crazy YouTubers, this is Mike from the Autograph Network, and I know what some of you guys are tuning in to see. You're looking for an angry response video to Zane Savage. You're not going to get it, guys. Um, I'm going to address a couple things, I'm going to defend myself, and I'm moving on. This channel has never been about drama, it's been about autographs, and that's the way it's going to be. I'll tell you right now, I'm not going anywhere, and I'm not going to do anything different than what I've been doing. I did get mail in today, uh, TTMs, I did get one private address, and I'm going to show you guys exactly how I find the private addresses and how easy this one was to find. Um, I did get a package from YouTube, which I apologize right now, Nick, that your your mail day is going to be in this video. Um, but I'll show you your stuff, and, and this has nothing to do with you. So I, I apologize right up front for that. Uh, I do want to address a couple things. Uh, I've seen the video, and like I said, I'm going to do a couple things, and then I'm moving on. Um, yeah, I two years ago, basically when I started the Autograph Network and the Members Only site, I had a certain list. But I have stopped using that, and I am almost exclusively online now. And the reason for that is Zane and Stacy have talked about it. Right on Autograph Weekly, books and hard copies of address lists are outdated. Addresses change daily, so I do all my stuff online now because that's the most up-to-date information. And I'll show you guys right on the screen with the private address that I got in, just how simple it is. Um, I've PM Zane. I told him exactly how I found the addresses that... He said that I've pilfered from his list. So I will show you guys just how easy it was to find the address that I got back today. So let's get on to the mail, guys. Uh, like I said, YouTube, I apologize right now, Nick. Um, I know you I know you'll understand. But from my buddy Nick, link down below. Stucky is the best three. Good kid can't apologize enough brother um, that it's going to be like this you know it has nothing to do with you but uh, we did a little trade he's going down to spring training and good luck man um, I hope you get some awesome stuff I can't wait to see it uh, traded him some Rackers cards which the link for Rackers is down below and uh, some other customs that I had because he's going down to spring training to get some IP autographs but here's what we traded Sammy Cassell Mr. Perfect, Mark Burley. Mr. Flop, Greg Olden. A Bruce Jenner uh, index card, and he was nice enough to send this as an extra. Um, Sports Illustrated preview, Kemba Walker, because he knows I live in Connecticut. So thank you, Nick, again, for sending the extra, for the trade, um, for the note. And again, I apologize, bro. Um, on to the mail. I did get a fail from Hartford. It's not an RTS, but I got one of these letters. Uh, Dear Mr. Rhodes, blah, blah, blah. Because stuff is sold on eBay and other internet sites, we can't sign your stuff. It was from Jasper Johns. He's a pretty famous artist. He lives here in Connecticut. So there he is. Didn't sign. Show you his artwork, which is beautiful. That's the United States, if you can't tell. Michigan, Florida. California and then an awesome triple triple flag so did not sign because stuff gets sold uh, next one coming from California if you guys have seen oh forgot to show <laughs> got a little unicorn a little toy that might give it away seen Toy Story a lot of people have gotten them in uh, Charles Morris does the voice of Andy so nicely signed in silver there from the Toy Story uh, 3 on that one. Toy Story the original. Toys are back in town. Andy. And that's what that's what the voice of Andy looks like. So pretty cool. Um, this one's an awesome return. You guys saw my uh, Felix Baumgartner that I got back. And you guys know that I have a pending from the current record holder for the longest skydive. It is uh, Colonel Joe Kittinger. So there he is. 
that's a cool life picture shot from 1960. So there he is, pretty much falling from space. I think his jump was 19 miles up. And Felix is going to try and break that. Uh, to Archer, that's a cool art shot. Basically fell out of a capsule that looks like a spaceship. Here's the actual photo. Look how high that up is. That's, uh, that's amazing. And there's a much better wide angle shot. Um, then he sent this about his book, Come, Come Up and Get Me. So an autobiography, there's the cost. If you guys want to Amazon that, it's probably a great read, but um, just that's how far his fall was from, and 614 miles per hour is how fast he fell. Awesome. All right, guys, here we go. Time to show you how easy this was. West Palm Beach, Florida. That's the postmark. That's not where I sent it, so he probably took it with him. I'm assuming he's on vacation, but... It is from New England Patriots coach Bill Belichick. And again, this is a private address that is not on any of the paid sites. Nice one to Archer. Super Bowl 36, 38, and 39 champions. And here's a cool old school shot. Same inscription. That's him on the left there. So what I'm going to show you guys. So I use one of these sites. I use many different sites now to find addresses, but I'm not going to, I'm sure you guys can figure this out. Find a business, find people, type in the name, do a little Google search, find out a little about him. He coaches for the Patriots. I would assume he has a house there. Now, we'll wait for the results to come up. There's 11 results. And I'm not going to scan down because there's other people's addresses here. But there you go. William Belichick. You guys want to write to him? P.O. Box 715, Foxborough, Massachusetts. Click on that. And there's the zip code. You guys want to pause it? There's a private address for Bill Belichick. It's not that hard. So like I said, guys, I'm not changing what I do. I'm not leaving. It's going to be about autographs. Thank you to all the members of the Autograph Network. You guys have been awesome with the support. I appreciate it. I'm going to keep doing what I'm doing. I don't feel like I have to talk about this much more. And we'll just go on. Again, I apologize to Nick. I wish you the best in uh, your spring training trip with your IPs. I can't wait to see them. Apologize again. You guys feel free to write to Bill Belichick. And the reason I showed that guy is because it's a P.O. box. I wouldn't do that with somebody's home address. But that's how easy it was. If you know what to look for, it's there. But... It is what it is. So like I said, there's always two sides to every story. Mike from the Autograph Network is out.